So what I was riding before was like a road bike. Um, and when I tried to set up a bike seat on there, it didn't work. To get the baby off the back, it basically takes two people. And that was not convenient, obviously. We kind of lived with it because it was all we had and we made it work. And we started to want to use the bike more for running errands uh, with uh, our daughter. We had a basket on the front. We used to load a ton of stuff in there, but as soon as you had that loaded and you had the kid on the back, it was all just kind of very fall happy. And so we got rid of that basket on the front and um, we either wore a backpack, which would then you know bump into the baby's face. Going up hills was a pain in the butt, and you know, just with all that extra weight as she got bigger, uh, and it just was pretty cumbersome. I spent a bunch of money to get a specialized kickstand for my old bike so that I could also put Zoe on the back of that one if I needed to. But even this you know, specialty kickstand that I got, it's just too tippy. That whole bike is too top heavy with her on it, and I cannot take my hands off of her when I'm putting her on and, and sort of getting the buckles. If I have forgotten to grab anything that we're taking with us, I have to just leave it behind because I can't let her go when she's on the bike. Whereas the Yuba Mundo is so steady and for precious cargo, that is key to the operation. That's a huge selling point for me. So as Zoe was getting bigger, we realized that our setup was not gonna work for much longer and we needed a new solution. And that's when we found Yuba. We needed safety, we needed power, we needed the ability to carry more things and use it really to replace a car. Well, as we were deciding to make the purchase and Fossey told me what the bill was going to be on this expenditure, I said, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> that is way too much money for a bike. We started doing the math and racking it up and saying, well, we actually do do a lot of in-town trips that we'd rather bike to. So it began to make sense. The moment that I went down to the store and picked up my actual Yuba Mundo, it just felt so solid and it was just so cozy and we were just kind of cruising around. I just wanted to keep riding it. And then when I got the electrified one, I was like, I feel like a superhero. Like I flew, I remember just like riding all over town. I went up these hills and it just felt so amazing. It's great for family trips. We've had a lot of fun just doing errands around town. It turns running errands into like a more fun adventure. It's health and transportation and your own personal sanity. I work about five miles from my house. You know, that time on the bike is my sort of like personal therapy to kind of debrief and, and by the time I arrive home, I'm recharged and renewed and much better than I am when I arrive home in a car. We were fortunate that we were able to squeeze it into our budget and we've been very happy that we did uh, because once you make that investment and you realize that you're saving money on gas and you're getting exercise and you're outside and you're helping Mother Earth and all the benefits that are unique to this bike, it's absolutely worth it.